karibu tuzo online Taifa Stars uh, on behalf of players please <laughs> okay, kwanza tunapenda kushukuru Mungu kwamba tumecheza mechi yetu kule Misri, tumemaliza vyema na tulipata matatizo madogo ambayo mchezaji mwezetu alipata majeraha, lakini sisi wengine tunaendelea vizuri na tunashukuru Mungu kwamba tumefika salama Tanzania na tumepokelewa vizuri. Uh, kila kitu kinaendelea sawa, sisi tupo tayari kwa, kwa ajili ya mechi ya kesho na tupo tayari kupambana kuona tuna pindua matokeo kwa sababu kule kwetu tumepoteza na tumekuja hapa kupambana kwa kisha tunapata matokeo mazuri. Sisi uh, kazi yetu kama wachezaji wa zoefu ni kuhakikisha vijana wanakuwa na na wanakuwa comfortable wanapokuja kwenye timu ya taifa kwa sababu kuna uzito fulani kwenye kuvaa jezi ya timu ya taifa na lakini sisi tuna, kazi yetu ni kuhakikisha wapo vizuri na wanapata maneno mazuri na kupata nini mwelekeo mzuri kutokea sisi kwetu na kweli kama ulivyosema na vijana wengi ambao ndo mara yao ya kwanza kuja na kesho mambo yatakuwa mazito na yatakuwa magumu wanjani lakini sisi kazi yetu na bench la ufundi ni kuhakikisha wapo tayari kisaikolojia na wapo tayari kimwili na wapo wanajua wao wanajua majukumu ambayo yamewaleta huko ni vijana wadogo lakini kwenye mpira hamna kijana mdogo kwenye mpira kila mtu ana majukumu yake na kuhakikisha kila mtu ana, ana, anafanya vizuri kama bench la ufundi watakavyoanda kesho this games if not the best in the world and it's a game that connects a lot of people uh, in my time since i started playing football i've moved around so many countries and i've met so many people but uh, i have to say that uh, this is the country we have mess, uh, made most friends and uh, most of the people in the Tanzanian team are my friends because I've played either against them or with them in the same team. So it's really something that uh, you look at uh, people you're playing against, they're not your enemies, they're friends, but uh, in, during the 90 minutes we are ready to put uh, friendship aside and fight and then after the 90 minutes we can shake hands and smile and do everything. But during the 90 minutes we are ready to fight and give our best and make sure we crush them. Uh, in uh, Egypt, we lost the game, but uh, we thank God that we was able to reach here successfully. Everything is going well so far. We are well prepared as players and everyone in the, in the team. And uh, we are looking forward to changing the result to, in tomorrow's game to fight hard. We are ready to fight and make sure that we get the required results. We need the three points because, uh, to put our chances well to be able to qualify out of the group into the AFCON. We know where we have wronged, but you need to understand uh, we, are, we are totally two different teams in, in different missions. Uh, for example, we are playing against the team that has uh, players from t uh, two top eight teams in Cup, Confederation Cup and uh, Champions League. We are playing against the, the team that has established players that have gone through the hardships of, of uh, uh, Morocco to Saudi Arabia and uh, all over the Europe. Uh, on the other side, we are having uh, s few uh, senior players that are leading the transition of our team from the point of building, and we are banking so much on the generation that played final of Africa Cup of Nations in Mauritania 2021. Uh, practically, we are looking, we are looking uh, senior players to present and protect their reputation. We are looking forward uh, young players to get introduced and there is no better place than Benjamin Kappa to turn from boys to men. Uh, whatever was wrong in last match from a point of transition and it's very hard to make transition when you have when you have a uh, disciplined team of defenders where three central defenders plus uh, uh, Novatos plus uh, Himid Mao, plus uh, Zamir Yassin and, and, and um, Mutakir Yahya, uh, practically uh, uh, it, is, it was very hard for us to break that wall. However, now with uh, Shamari and, and um, Shabalala, we are having a situation we shall see. Small details will decide uh, and we believe that this time we believe, we have right to believe and hope is something that never dies inside us, I believe, and I live in uh, with ten philosophy since I have come to Africa 21 years ago. Uh, when it's good, do not fly high. 
when it's bad, never say die, never give up. And this is what I want to inject my uh, fellow. I don't call them players because I love them too much. Uh, I don't just coach them. I love them. And I want them just to be themselves and to present them in the best possible way and represent country in the best possible way. Uh, you know, after every match, you analyze what is good. You try to keep it up. What is wrong, you try to um, correct and to not repeat what was wrong. Uh, we are deeply analyzing today's training. Uh, will definitely answer us who are the people that will start. But in football, is something that is called the impact of fresh legs. Uh, we have not been happy. Uh, last time we had unfortunate situation at our middle fielder that we expected so much. Servada, he has just today returned back to America because of injury that he needed to come. We expected much more, and this is exactly the element where we have cracked. We are looking to find a solution uh, uh, for the, I want to call it a uh, trinity, trinity of uh, uh, strong middle field, uh, creative middle field of uh, iron defense against very good attackers of opponent, and then sharp attack that will expose uh, perfect team does not exist on this planet. Uh, therefore, uh, our respected opponents have uh, points of danger and we respect them and we shall look to, to close those points of danger. Also, they have uh, sources of vulnerability that we shall try to expose. And is a game, uh, I'm very delighted to be part of this because it's an action thriller and I'm action thriller, uh, thriller uh, uh, editor for last 21 years in Africa and I believe that I will succeed to convince uh, our players, they are fully aware of everything. I want to take pressure from them. I want to give them opportunity to present themselves in the best possible way, represent the country in the best possible way. And we are looking forward to one good match tomorrow evening. Sit here if I don't believe that uh, I will. And I'm not in, uh, uh, from yesterday in football. I'm from day before yesterday. Therefore, uh, fully aware where we are coming, fully aware that we had no chance to play at Nambole Stadium where we, sh we would have our player number 12, our supporters. Uh, in a neutral ground, our brothers took advantage, got the win, congratulations, we have the highest degree of respect for them. We have also highest degree of respect for them for tomorrow's match. We know that they will have player number 12 on their side, however, as I told, I have the highest degree of uh, trust, confidence, and belief in, in uh, players. Trust, confidence, and belief in myself that we shall succeed to, to turn the corner and to get the result that we are looking for tomorrow. It will be a match that uh, I hope everyone will enjoy, whether on television, whether on the ground. We are playing against brothers. Small details decide. We know them. They know us. Let us see what football will bring. It will be one, I believe, uh, uh, action football thriller and this uh, we are ready for.